Hello everybody, welcome back. Jordan here. Today is a very exciting day. It's February 1st, 2022, and there's a bunch of new Lego sets that are hitting the shelves this morning. So what are we doing? Well, of course, we're going to head to the Lego store to check out those new releases. There's some exciting stuff. The Lego Ideas Globe, some licensed brickheads, and there's also some other things that we're looking for as well. So I'm really excited to head to the Lego store today to do some Lego shopping. Woohoo! Looks like uh, we're gonna get a free vintage taxi if you spend $255 here in Canada. Pretty cool looking promo. In the front window here, we have Sonic the Hedgehog. Also, the globe. They've got it built on display. Oof, it looks really good. It's a perfect size, I think. It looks phenomenal. And you know what else looks phenomenal? Well, of course, the Titanic. Yes. Right below the Disney castle, beside the UCS ATAT, -AT, and of course, the Technic BMW motorcycle. Well, I guess we can get a better view of it inside the store here. Wow, look at the globe. It looks fantastic. I was just talking with the manager of the store, and she says that it spins so cleanly on the axis, and I believe it. It looks fantastic. I love its brown stand there, and also the base with those print pieces. Also, the print pieces for the oceans and continents glow in the dark. There's a sailboat and a compass on the globe. It just looks really clean. And of course, that's gonna be on the shelf in our favorite department right over here in the Lego Creator Expert 18 plus area where we have things like the police station, Hogwarts icons, the globe right there. It's gonna retail for $269.99 here in Canada. So if you get that, then of course, you're gonna get one of the taxis for free which is actually on display over here let's check that out it's on this little pod right here so free gift with purchase when you spend over 255 dollars it's the vintage taxi it looks pretty good yellow and black comes with this neat looking minifigure there as well and a little uh, tiled off sort of sidewalk or road i guess looks like a good little uh, promo for sure not bad Not a bad little vehicle for the city. We'll do a little fly by the gunship here. So yeah, if we get uh, the globe, which of course we're gonna do today, that's why we're here, uh, you're gonna get the vintage taxi for free. It looks really clean. So Lego idea set number 40, uh, it got 2,585 pieces. 21332 is the set number. 18 plus style box. I'm just like touching the box. The globe is just, illuminating off that black packaging. On the back side of the box here, you can see the size of the globe. So it stands 16 inches or 40 centimeters tall, 10 inches or 26 centimeters wide. I see the police station, I see Assembly Square, and I see Birch Books, but I don't see the brand new one, uh, the Boutique Hotel in stock anywhere. But other than that, I mean, a massive selection of great Lego sets in this department. Whoa, Lloyd's Legendary Dragon actually looks pretty awesome. Oh my gosh. And so does the Ninja Dojo Temple here. Looks pretty awesome in the Ninjago department, of course. Then we've got the UCS ATAT, Moss Eisley Cantina, and a whole bunch of awesome stuff in the Star Wars department. We've seen the slots before. And you know what? I'm really excited for March. March, there's a lot of great stuff coming out including some new Star Wars helmets, a new battle pack, and also the new Speed Champions as well. March is gonna be an absolutely incredible month for LEGO releases. Some other new stuff that we got in store today is actually right over here, swinging past my globe. It's uh, right over here in the Brickhead department. So for Brickheads in February, we got uh, the Demogorgon and 11 for Stranger Things. I love the Demi Gorgon. We gotta get one of those, right? And then we also got uh, Roadrunner and Wiley Coyote. And then Buzz Lightyear. Oh, there should be another one too. There should be Woody and Bo Peep. But unfortunately, I don't see them on this display here. But the three that they do have in stock, they have built. So we've got Buzz, I love the look at Buzz. Also Wiley Coyote and the Roadrunner. And then the Demi Gorgon and Eleven. We got to get all those. It's too bad they don't have the Woody and Bo Peep in stock, though. I'm surprised by that. 
And also beside Buzz here, we have the Easter Rabbits display. And that's a brand new product as well. Something my mom wanted me to get for her was actually the Valentine Lovebirds, but looks like they're sold out of those as well. So I'm unable to get those, but for sure we're gonna get the three brick heads. Ooh, they've got the sunflowers on display here, but unfortunately they are sold out of those again. Jose really wants to get those. <laughs> they look really good beside the roses. There's a couple other products that are delayed here in February as well. We were supposed to get some more keychains, such as Darth Maul, Big Bird, Ernie, stuff like that. Uh, they're not in stock. There's some other keychains here, but none of the February releases. In this department, seems like they're pretty well stocked. They got some of the Batman stuff. Also the Batwing beside the Tumblr. And over here, I've spotted something that we want to get because we want to do the rebrickable model of the university, Hogwarts Castle. Retailing for $500 comes with all the minifigures, 6,020 pieces. Oh my gosh, do we get a Hogwarts castle? I haven't seen it in stock in a while. And there it is. And then of course we've got Hedwig right here in the Hogwarts icon set. Oh, what do we do though? Do we get the Hogwarts castle? I see it in stock today, ready to go. And we could build that university in the very near future if we pick this up. I don't know what to do. I don't know if we should get that or not. I really want to, $500 isn't cheap, but it'd be a sick model to build and put in the city, right? I don't know what to do. <laughs> uh, I gotta get the globe, right? That's brand new and it looks amazing. And I've got the perfect spot for it in the Lego city. No, not in the Lego city, no, in the Lego room, sorry. I've got the perfect spot for this in the Lego city. I've gotta give that some thought. Uh, one other thing that we need to get is more road plates, those being the new ones, of course. And I'm gonna see if they have any in stock here in the city department. Okay, so they have the new hospital. They've got the train back in stock, the passenger train. I haven't seen those in a while. They've got some switch tracks. Uh, they got the stunt guy. There you go, the chicken stunt guy. I got one of those from Walmart the other day. Uh, they got the new mobile crane. They've got the older ice cream truck. Probably the newer one somewhere as well, the ice cream crooks, yeah, right over here. But I don't see any road plates, that's good. <laughs> no, it's not good, I need them. But we need to get like 35 packs if we're to convert the entire city to mills, isn't that crazy? But I don't see any here, so it's not even like I can pick up one or two of them to, you know, test some roads and make some different uh, combinations of T's and turns and straights and, and stuff like that. So unfortunately, no roads in stock right now, uh, but I do see the question mark block and some Mario stuff and also all the friend stuff, but nothing really new in these departments. We've already seen all of the new stuff, that being the brick heads and also the globe. Okay, so here beside the Disney department where we have like the ice castle and, and the Disney castle, of course, we've got the pick a brick wall. So, this is gonna become very important to us in the future because we need to get things for our mills plates. For example, two by two brick. We're gonna need a lot of that. And there's a lot of that always here on this wall. Also like dark bluish gray or light bluish gray plate, even green plate, blue plate, stuff like that. We're gonna need a lot of it. I don't see a whole lot of pieces that we need other than the two by two bricks on the wall here, but I don't really wanna stock up in a lot of those until we get started with our big project. I do see some tan plate in two by eight, but I don't really see any larger plates right now, that being like four by four or four by six, or sometimes you even see eight by eight on the wall. Oh, here's some four by six in blue. So when we do the ocean, that's a long time away. I'm gonna need a bunch of that to do the ocean properly in a mill style, which would be really cool because we'll be able to like put the boats in the water. You know what I mean? Like inset them in the plates, give it depth so you can actually have the boats look proper. Like they're sort of sitting in the water. You know what I mean? So I can't wait to do that. It's gonna be a big project, a big experiment, but this wall here is gonna be essential to fueling that project, I think. And of course, Bricklink Sellers and Pab and BAP, anywhere you can buy a Lego in bulk online as well. In the Technic department, we've got like the Lamborghini, the Ferrari, 
uh, the Jeep Wrangler, the Senna, the Ford Raptor, the BMW motorcycles, some of the new pullback vehicles. I don't see any of the big equipment like the Volvo or the Cats or anything like that. And then we've got uh, some brickheads on sale here as well still. Overall, uh, February is a pretty chill month. Oh, there's the, uh, the Tiger as well, the Majestic Tiger in the three-in-one apartment just above the pirate ship there. Yeah. So what are we going to do today? Well, I've got some stuff at the counter there, and I'm still thinking about that Hogwarts. It's been a while since we've seen it. All right, so we got our globe, and we got our brick heads, and we got our vintage taxi promo. There it is. Looks good, eh? Like the 18 plus style packaging, just like the boutique hotel. What a fantastic little promo. Love that. Actually looks really nice on display there too. It, it looked better in person than it did online or on the available images or in the available images. You know what I mean? I just think it looks pretty sweet. So we got this stuff here. Yeah, we got Hogwarts as well. <sighs> well, I think I did something I shouldn't have. No, I'm just kidding. We need that. We've been looking for a Hogwarts castle for quite some time. We've even been looking on our local classifieds and stuff like that. And here's what we're going to build with it. Yeah, doesn't that look good? Like it's an amazing rebrickable model that's just incredible. So we're gonna put that to good use. And then of course we've got the globe that we're gonna be building straight away here. Also all those brick heads, but no uh, sunflowers and no Valentine lovebirds for my mom. And also uh, no uh, Woody and Bo Peep brick head. But the other brick heads look really good. There we go, I can't wait to get the stuff brought home here. All right, so definitely not a bad little haul. More than I anticipated, all right? <laughs> Did we really need to get all of that? Yeah, maybe, I don't know. It's gonna look really good when we place that university in the Lego City, I think. Uh, the taxi cab promos are good, so that's good that we got a couple of those. And then we got the globe, right? The globe looks amazing. I can't wait to build that later on today. That's gonna be epic it's gonna be a fun build a little bit repetitive but it's gonna look fantastic i'm hyped on that and then also the brickheads missing one of them but not bad we got uh some licensed brickheads coming out in 2022 that's a good thing i'm i'm excited about that licensed brickheads disney and stuff and warner bros i guess so that's awesome beauty what a haul so everybody there's our february 1st 2022 lego shopping haul we got more than what we expected <laughs> that happens all too often doesn't it everybody thank you so much for coming on by uh, stay tuned for some more great stuff and uh, remember to like and subscribe farewell have a great day